Hey guys, so I'm finally back from Boston Comic Con, and it's been a while since I've done a movie, but they're doing yard work outside my dorm room because I'm now on the first floor because, as you saw in a couple of previous videos, I'm now in my new location for my senior year. Either way, now I'm back from Boston Comic Con. I had a great time hanging out with Katie because we always have a fun time being nerds, having great conversations about fan fiction and the way that Marvel and DC are handling their characters and which characters have been mishandled and so many great things. We went to a really awesome panel on Sunday. There weren't too many good ones we went to, but we went to a really awesome queer panel on Sunday and it was so much fun and full of a lot of laughs and I'm very glad that we were able to go. Even though we go for three days of convention, it's really more about us hanging out and less about how much time and panels we actually go to. Plus, we get to be nerds and we love being surrounded with our comic book community. Also, if you haven't noticed, I got a new tattoo. It is Star Wars related because I'm a huge nerd, but also because Star Wars has played a huge impact in my life. It was one of the first movies as a kid that my mom really shared with me. I got a minimalistic Millennium Falcon with the Han Solo quote, never tell me the odds, because I've always believed in taking risks, even though sometimes I lead my life very cautiously. But there are times when you really do need to take a risk and me moving all the way out here a couple years ago was a huge risk and I didn't know how well that would turn out and it's been so rewarding to have moved out here. And now on to comics. In some previous videos I had talked about comics and my love for them and that I really wanted to do more with all of the comics that I've been writing reviews about and if you didn't know I was writing reviews about comics, well, check my blog down there in the doobly-doo. And I also post my... I'm starting to post my reviews on Goodreads. I have so many comics to read and probably not nearly enough time to read them. So I'm trying to read and write about them and I'm learning so much from so many different comics. But the tough part is, is figuring out what to do with all that knowledge. So if you have an idea on what I should do with all of that knowledge, let me know in the doobly-doo below because that'll kind of give me a little more guidance on what I should really do with all this information. Also, if you follow me on Twitch, I haven't been able to stream because I've been so busy and RA training is about to start soon. It's gonna get busy. But now we should take a look at everything I've purchased over the weekend so you can see what I'm going to be writing reviews for. So, introducing the pile. It's a lot of comics. Plus, Spider-Gwen, Captain Marvel, and then the comics that are standing up over here are some of the ones I've already read. Anyway, so now that you're back, keep me posted on what you're reading in the comments below, and if you have any ideas for what I should be doing with all of this comic book knowledge that I'm slowly gaining, because eventually I do want to write for Marvel. So stay excellent, don't forget to be awesome, bye!